yeah afternoon guys yeah this is the tutorial based on exceptional handling yeah as you can see that i've already started with the whole design and all that um uh here we're going to try and create a program that will divide two numbers yeah, that will divide two numbers and give us the answer this is my button um and this will be my uh this is in fact this is my edit box my first edit box for number one and uh, number one my second edit box for num two which is number two and then the last edit box will be where our answer will be placed in therefore i think we should start okay let's go to the button because the button is the most important part and then uh we can we can start by writing our program we can start by writing our program yes i start with my try and crash because you guys have to understand you guys have to understand that whenever you ba basically want to do a program the exceptional handling uh, process it's based on writing a code uh, a code of any means however you've got to understand that the the exceptional handling process it's been caught by the catch or by these two in fact these two transit so in other words we're gonna write our code the code that we are supposed to write has to be e within the try statement and here we will place whatever that we deem to have uh, been out of way to be placed here maybe this can be some sort of we can display it yeah we can, okay we'll try to display it and see for you what to do you guys you'll d you'll see what i will do then let's try i told you that we have an, our first we have our, um, an edit box that will get an, one number and an, an, another edit box that will get another number and we divide the number we can just come here first and say int getting the answer int answer and then what we do i don't know maybe there are other ways of doing this but i want to do it in one lane and then i'll say my answer it's equals to the edit box well i've named my edit box i have edit i have edit sorry i have edit a and then you know i have edit a which is like this edit a like this and out you know that the edit one thing that you know one thing that you should know that in the edit box um any edit box it's in string okay say answer string can okay, see string therefore you have to understand that this answer i have said it should be in an integer so i have to convert everything to be an integer I have to contact it to be, to be what to be an integer since I would like to deal with numbers. If I want to enter a number, I would like to have a number being entered. And therefore, I should somehow convert whatever is being entered to a, an int. And then now I will say divide, you know, division by the other one was my other edit box was edit was edit b for simplicity this was just for simplicity don't get confused in any way and then like this and then what do i do it's text then the text like this again i have to convert because in the edit b i have to enter a number therefore this should be to what to an int i guess you are all understand and my program is like this yeah therefore the you have to understand one thing that here it's the answer but here 
the answer is just an integer which I have created here. It has nothing to do with the answer which is here on the design part. This is a label. It is not a name that definitely. So, but what I'm concerned about is this edit box because the answer has to be in the edit box. These are just labels, labels that somehow, yeah, I've placed my caption that somehow gives me uh, an idea of what's happening below the edit box so let's come to our program then then th they will ask you one thing i mean okay then we we go first then we go and place our answer in our correct edit box and the edit box i had was edit was edit d that for the answer for the answer part which i'll know if d text it's always in text equals to what to an answer but we know that now we have to put the answer the answer has to be placed in the edit box and then the edit box always contains or always requires anything to be placed there in tag I mean in, in, in strings therefore we have to say um, string we have to say uh, you like this we have to say like this we convert it to a string so if we, we convert it to a string we convert it to a string we we say uh, int uh, to string this is our own and then it is our own conversion and then we place what answer there that's my answer this answer is what i've calculated here and this is basically my program remember now you 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 may ask yourself some questions or maybe a question and say then what's happening where are these handlers or uh, these errors and exception that are you catching no in fact I, I would like to catch my my mind in fact now I may say I would like to catch everything maybe or anything but basically i will show you an example of what i mean here i have um to catch but why am i catching you can write if maybe you want to catch an exception that you know you can write exceptional of arithmetic but now i want to i want us to to what to just catch anything it's fine they will just say catch errors or exception handling let's just use uh exceptional handling and then what do you do our exception that, that catches everything and then um what you, are, you have to understand we have these ex exception handlers we have these exceptional handlers uh i don't know if you guys will understand we have these exceptional handlers a lot of them a lot but what are we focusing on we are focusing on this one this one is the most important ex this one it requires that all of them be in encapsulated within one bound so if you understand that these represent the exception that can collect everything whether it's an exception of database know that you use this one however i i i don't want to do that for now i don't want to do that i have my i, I don't want to do that for now I, I already have an exception that i wanted to do i just want to use this one i want you to get this i've created it because i've just created my own i mean this button so that you guys you know how the format is about just the format it's nothing much and then i will take this one and copy it here just for message dialogue so that you understand what exceptional handlings this means that i'm catching everything anything that comes that is an error i'm changing everything then now we would like to uh, show you that this is a message dialogue that will say there was an error and then it ca gives us that error and then these are my buttons of okay so you see that or whatever you all know that so we are catching everything and then this is it but these this other way that i would have to show you again and then we're gonna save our program and run it and you'll understand what we mean by that there i say i'm going then listen i'm running uh my program where i have errors what is my errors maybe i haven't uh, the answer and what's wrong with my answer 
uh, it's an answer maybe let me try and take it there okay i know why because this w the w but yeah i made my mistake yeah let me pocket it straight so that everything is in order yeah my answer didn't copy it quite well uh and then like this then we save it again and we run it for you guys and then voila magic no errors and then check now i would like to say 12 divided by 4 4 you see 3 you see guys it's 3 okay fine i would like to run it again let's see what i do now um i run it now i would like to say 12 I would like to say 12 divide by 0. See what's happened. Do you see? The exception of message cannot, it's an integer divided by 0. You can say, you'll see, there was an error. The message that I have written there, it's here. There was an error. If you like, you can continue what I've written. There was an error since you can see, you can see from here that I've said there was an error i didn't really want to say what an error was but there was an error that's it so if you like you can even come and run it again you can come and run it again and you see what i mean um what i mean is that we can maybe do something again we can do something uh uh maybe try to say zero now and check track zero and and then like this and then like this and then like this you see ff it's not a valid integer you see fd what what is not a, so it it takes all exception and there was an error this is a message of us that has been displayed to us and that's it and if you like and say zero divide by 12 and you know zero by divided by 12 and zero divided by 12 you know that it's zero and the answer is zero but we cannot say what 12 divide a number cannot be divided by what by zero that's why when we divide it by zero let me just get like this and we we, we we know that we cannot divide an answer by by zero by zero we cannot divide by an answer by zero like you can see here i can say i repeat again so that you can see 25 divide by zero then i say uh, i divide you can say it's an error this integer divided by zero it's out of order and then the same message will pop up and say there was an error this is my message you can write your own message maybe there was an error if you know what you want to do and that's basically what we wanted to show you guys thank you and we can we'll venture much about it we'll try to uh, let me try and recap uh, this for you here is just a code this code you can write it anywhere without uh, including the catch and, and, and if, if you're not given we, we could have some written a code without including the try and on all these catch and anything would have worked fine but because we want to catch errors we just include catch and then this one and then like this and then you're done and then you write what definitely should be catch i mean what you want to display after this watch the catch part that's in the catch part you definitely definitely i mean most times we display what have been caught or we display that there was an error it's simply because at the first time when i say 12 divided by 4 we are, I, get, I got 3 there wasn't any message that was displayed because the the the, the 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 whole process never got to the catch at all it didn't come to the catch because there was no need because nothing was caught it just gave me the answer into my edit box d and that's all guys i think you'd understand that and everything it's well impact thank you for your time uh, as i promised i deliver today thank you guys god bless